Zar Woodcutter is the most advanced, most safe, and most reliable woodcutter on OS Bot. You can bot 99 woodcutting with only a couple clicks. From regular trees to redwood trees chop any tree you like. Keep the logs and bank them or drop them for quicker XP. Select areas easily from our list or from the game map or tag them on the screen. Yellow means unsaved tree, green means saved. Select as many as you like. Otherwise load the map and draw your own area to select trees and the bot will walk there with the web walking system. Once you fill out the setup window the map appears. Drag your mouse to move around the map, hold and draw a box of trees and then select start bot. We pay attention to detail. Fossil Island tree patches including the shortcut too. You have special settings such as collecting bird nests, random mouse profiles, mouse off screen like a human watching movies and many more. Next we have the breaks and pause settings. For better results with botting you can use the built-in scheduling break manager. You can choose a range of numbers for randomization. You can choose how long to bot for and how long to stay logged out for. Everything is randomized to avoid bans. Even supports AFK logging out like real humans do every day. Control when to stop the bot. It's possible to program the bot to stop at certain points such as time, items gained, levels gained, and many more. Bonus plugins are included for free, with our first one being the famous hardwood grove woodcutting with the parcel service. Amass plentiful mahogany or teak logs for incredible profits. This is the only bot to support this feature. Here you can queue certain tasks to occur and progressively chop trees with conditions such as level reached, number of logs chopped, time, or unlimited. Use this to level your fresh accounts from level 1 to 99 while switching trees as you level up. The quickest way to 99 is to do trees until 15, oaks until 30 and willows until 70, teaks until 99. This bot supports automated mass farming via CLI. You can export the settings via the top left menu. It's also possible to save and load profiles for easier access. For more information and questions, join our official Discord channel.